Hi, everybody. Today, we're going to read the story, What If Everybody Did That? I want you to think about what the world would be like if maybe there was something that you wanted to do and everybody did the same thing. Would there be something good come from it? Would something bad come from it? Would it be frustrating for people? Would people be happy with it? We got to think about if we did certain things, how would it feel if everyone did that? This book is silly, but I also want you to think in a serious way. If maybe you made some decisions that were good or bad, and if everybody did those same things. I hope you enjoy What If Everybody Did That by Ellen Javernick, illustrated by Colleen M. Madden. When we went to the zoo, I fed just a little of my popcorn to the bear. The zookeeper waved his broom and said, what if everybody did that? I just wanted to see how fast the grocery cart would go. It went faster than I expected. When the manager stopped me, she said, what if everybody did that? On the way to visit grandma and grandpa in Kansas, I dropped just one soda can out the window. The patrolman who pulled us over said, what if everybody did that? At Uncle William's wedding, I took just a little lick of the frosting from the fancy cake. The lady behind the table glared at me over her glasses and said, what if everybody did that? I told the babysitter that I took a bath just once a year and she shooed me into the bathroom. She said, Phew, what if everybody did that? During story time, I had something important to say. I just couldn't wait till the end of the story. The librarian put her finger to her lips and said, what if everybody did that? I gotta go potty. Why can't we read one of the other books? I've already heard this one. I can touch my toes, see? How much do you weigh? I am so hungry. My mom said that recycling is a very good thing and we have recycle in our house and I once. While we sat in the car waiting for dad, I honked the horn. I just honked a few times, but Mr. Thompson came to his door. He shook his head and said, what if everybody did that? Beep, beep, honk, honk, beep, 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 honk, 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 honk beep. At the swimming pool, I just splashed a little. The lifeguard blew his whistle and said, hey, what if everybody did that? On the bus, I just stood up to see the fire truck. Mr. Gearshift glared at me in the rearview mirror and said, Hey, what if everybody did that? Sit down, sit down, sit down. Just once. I didn't hang my coat on the rack at school. Miss Sanders made me pick it up and said, What if everybody did that? At recess, I threw just one snowball at Sammy. Mr. Walters saw me. When he sent me to stand by the wall, he said, now what if everybody did that? When we went out for dinner, I just shot one straw wrapper. The waitress stopped taking our orders and looked straight at me. She said, what if everybody did that? After the football game, I just ran on the field to get the quarterback's autograph. The official waved his arms and said, what if everybody did that? When I came home, I gave my mom a hug. What if everybody did that? Everybody should. So the book shows a few things that may not be so great if everybody did them. And here at the end, just giving a hug, if everyone did that, so many people would be happy and feel loved. It's pretty easy to think about all the good things that you could do to make people happy, to maybe help someone out, to do something nice. So the next time you think about doing something that's not so nice, 
Think about what would happen if everybody did that bad thing.